Good morning, uh, good afternoon, Andy, I should say. We're joined by nine-year veteran safety, James Ahedabo, who was born in Massachusetts, but has been living here in Houston for the past six years. So this is sort of your new hometown, James. Tell me about what it's like to have the Super Bowl here in H-Town. Um, I think it's, you know, phenomenal. I think it's a great idea, and it's the city has done an excellent job executing it. Um, if you look, you know, the fan experience and the way they've kind of transformed the city, it's it's great for us, as well as, you know, the, uh, everyone in town to be able to come out and, and experience it as well. So it, it's it's great atmosphere down here. Now, for those that don't know, James is Super Bowl champion with the Baltimore Ravens. He played for the Bills last year. Now, living in Houston, I have to ask, next year would would you consider playing for the Texans you know I get asked that question all the time and um, you know although I'd be honored to you know haven't haven't crossed that stage that stage yet so don't know I mean definitely have a lot of friendships um, with players and relationships with you know uh, coach O'Brien and, and other uh, members of his staff you know from my days of playing in New England um, but you, you never know. You know, I never say never. And, you know, free agency is coming in March, and you know, we'll have to see that. I won't hold you to that, but I kind of want to. <laughs> <laughs> now, tell me about the, the charity you and your, your wife have and that you've been talking about here this morning. Yeah, so our charity is uh, Hope Africa, and it's an acronym for helping our people excel. And that's uh, students of African descent. You know, I personally, um, my parents are, you know, have, you know, come to the United States in, in the early 80s from Nigeria, both earned their PhDs in education, but they truly had to, you know, sacrifice so much um, to be able to achieve, you know, the American dream, so to speak, um, and allow me and my siblings to have the opportunity we have. So there's so many other uh, uh, other students that are out there that are just like, you know, my parents, just like myself, that you know have that, um, you know, mental capacity, have that desire to continue their education, but don't have the financials. And you know that's where Hope Africa comes in and are able to give them that financial, you know, boost, so to speak, for them to achieve their dreams. And um, we're having a great fundraiser, you know, Wednesday night at Grace's Restaurant. Right Right on Kirby, um, phenomenal you know list of, of guests that we have coming in from uh, former you know Texan and you know current Detroit Lion All Pro Glover Quinn, uh, Jerry Hughes, um, guys. The list goes on and on of NFL players that are going to be in attendance. So it's an opportunity for you know guests to come interact with players, enjoy the evening, uh, auction items. Um, everything it's 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 great but most importantly we're raising money for kids to attend college so we really encourage people to get involved in and in, in come support james ahead of a man of many talents nice to meet yeah. you man yeah, yeah. and that is what you can expect all week long here at radio row we'll be here reporting live i'm jake reiner kprc channel 2 news a remarkable story and a great cause jake thanks so much we are all